All right, let's see if my Paku is going to eat my minnow I just defrosted. I just defrosted it. The minnow normally swims to come eat. I freaked him out with the camera for some reason. All right, the Paku knows it's eating time right here. He's watching me what I'm going to put in here. I'm going to put a minnow in here. See if he comes up for it. It's up at the top. He's looking at it. He's looking at it. He hasn't came up for it yet. Alright, I'm going to drop a perch in here for him. Here's my Paku. I'm going to drop a perch. There he goes. He sees it. There he comes. He's eyeballing. This is the first. You know, he's freaking out because I got the camera here. I can't believe it. Here he comes for our algae wafer. Let's see if he notices the uh, perch at the bottom. He loves the algae wafers. Now the perch just moves. See, he grabbed it. That's a piece of perch that he's eating. What I do is I save all my whatever fish I catch. And it's cheaper for me to feed him. He freaked out when I brought up the camera this time. Okay, look at the time clock here. I was going to fast forward it, but I said some people like watching fish. So I didn't fast forward it. I do talk through it every now and then. But he takes about 10 minutes to 12 minutes to eat that dang piece of perch. The inside of it is probably still frozen because I keep it frozen and then I just throw it in some warm water when I'm going to feed them. I threw a frozen minnow at the top also. And that's normally what he does actually when I give him a piece of perch. He goes all the way to the side and he eats it by himself in the corner. And whatever pieces that he rips up or breaks apart or floats around in there really doesn't bother me because also I have the little catfish in there and the little catfish cleans up whatever he doesn't finish. But Pakus are pigs. They eat and eat. there's the catfish in the corner over there. See him? He's looking for some food also. But how the Paku tears the perch up, tears the fish up that I give him, all the little pieces the catfish swims around to pick up. There's a the catfish back there. See the catfish swimming around? Because he picks up all the little pieces that the Paku breaks off. That Paku is not even a year old yet. And if that were 55, it would be... If this tank were 55, he'd be almost outgrowing to 55. And the catfish is a pick this catfish. It only gets like maybe 5 inches. And the sole purpose why I got him in this tank... Is so he could keep the bottom of the tank clean. Sometimes I wonder if he gets any food to eat because whatever I throw in there, the damn Paku eats.
And he's probably wondering why I haven't left. Normally I leave him by now. But I'm just recording so you can watch him eat that. And I still have the minnow floating around at the top. But if it makes its way to the bottom, the catfish will eat it. See the catfish? I had to get the rest of this cut bait put away. This is what it is. It's just frozen pieces of fish that I, uh, when I catch my fish, I just cut them up in little pieces and save them for him or I use them as cut bait. See, he's breaking up all them little pieces, and that's what that catfish is swimming around picking up, all them little pieces that he's breaking off. I haven't threw a head or a tail in there yet. I don't know if he'll eat it. See the catfish? There he goes. He comes peeking out and coming around and grabbing a piece and swimming back. Nope. The head, I think, is still too big. I'd have to cut them down into pieces. Alright, well, I'm going to end it right there because he's not eating. He's watching me watch him. You see that eye? It's so funny how he moves his damn head when he watches you. Like, he actually, you know, in this 130, he has to turn his whole body to the side sometimes to look to see what's floating around the top of the tank. Alright, there he I'm trying to wait till he gets it all the way in his mouth so you can see it, but he's taking so long to eat it because I'm watching him. And the funny thing is, if I would have just put it in there and walked away, he would have been done with it already. There goes the catfish again, swimming around to grab some more pieces of it. He's probably thinking, what the hell did you do to me? You gave me something that was still frozen today. Other than this, if I really don't got time, I just throw in some algae wafers. He loves algae wafers. He'll eat... Uh, Peanuts, cashews, just make sure they're the unsalted ones. Uh, grapes, I throw, eh, grapes I have to split in half for him. And in all essence, when I feed him, just that one piece of perch, it's like I feed him both the fish, because you see the pick this catfish still swimming around. There he goes again, see? He grabs a piece of what's uh, broken off and then swims right back. No, oh, he almost got it off. You figure with those teeth he'd have it all devoured already
he breaks it apart really good for the catfish though. The catfish gets to run around and just pick up all the little pieces. Man, going on nine minutes that he's been trying to eat this one damn piece of uh, perch. What I'll do when I upload it, I'm probably going to put it in like double the motion so this way it don't take that long. It's almost all, almost all the way in there. I gotta get the rest of this cut bait in the freezer before it defrosts all the way. There's the catfish again. He's eating good too with less, with you know, not even all the hassle because he's just picking up the little pieces. Nope, there it went. Sucked it all in, you see it? I spit it right back out. Sucked it all back in again. Spit it back out again. I wonder why I keep banging it into the wall this time. And there's the catfish. It's funny if I put regular fish food in there, the catfish ain't as active as if I put uh, a piece of fish in there. There it is, all gone. It took him 12 minutes to eat that piece of perch. Guess how much it cost me. Free! Now he's gonna look for more food. I'm telling you, he's a. See? Looking for more food. He is a pig. Anyways, that's my Paku little squishy. And if you got this far into the video, you know that sucker came right back up and ate the damn minnow that I put in there in the beginning after he finished eating that piece of perch. Either way, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.